Charlottesville is open. Time to play. Card. It's worth a fortune. What's the big deal? Who's gonna notice? Jessica Walters, quick! Ah, uh, hey Jessica. Hey Matthew. Selling any good cards today? Uh, no. We already sold all the cards. Yeah. Sold them all, huh? That is too bad. But you know, Matthew. I am in the market for some new furniture, and well, what about that one? this would go great in my room. Uh, that's nice. How much for the desk? The desk isn't for sale. Good morning, Jessica. Uh, good morning, Mrs. Erickson. So, you're sure you don't want to sell this desk? Of course we're selling the desk. Oh. oh. Make an offer. Let's see. Um, how about 20? OK, fine, you win. But no deals. These cards are in mint condition. That's great. How much are these books, Mmm, strawberry. My favorite flavor. I'll give you two dollars for it. Two dollars? This card is in mint condition. This card is a collectible. Two dollars, not a penny more. But you only paid Bobby Staley a buck for it. Todd? Fine. Two dollars. Uh, do you have change for a 20? No. Oh, well, <laughs> the only other bill I have is, uh, well, it's just a one. Fine, just take it and get out of here. I need money. Can I talk to you for a minute? Yeah, sure. Well, um, well, Mom and Dad's anniversary is next week, and I found them a, a great picture frame, sterling silver. Oh, Mom loves pictures. Yeah, it's the perfect gift. Oh, yeah, yeah, it would be, if I could afford it. Look, I, I just need to borrow some money. I'll pay you back. Sam, with what? I have told you a million times. Yeah, I know, I know. I've got to start saving my money. You waste it on games and candy and toys. For what? Well, how about for fun? Look, Jess, I don't want to sit around all day counting money like you do. So I guess that's a no? Of course not. Hmm? I never give up a good business opportunity when I see one. Let's see, today's prime rate closed at 6%. So I will loan you the money at three points over prime. That is 9%. Forget it. I'll make him a keychain. Jessica, before you sit back to contemplate your financial empire, I need you to sweep out the attic. Mom, I don't want to spend my whole afternoon in some creepy old attic. But if you don't do it, Sam gets your allowance for the week. Well, that's not fair.
town. Carl stole the collector's edition. This could be worth a fortune. Hello? Mom, it's Jessica. Can you come up here? <laughs> Are you okay? What is it? Over here. I want to show you something. It's some kind of miniature town. Wow, this is really something. I wonder who left it here. Probably the previous owners. Can I have it? Sure. Looks like fun. Fun? It's a collector's edition. It could be worth something. I'll sell it and make some money. You can keep the model town, but don't sell it. I want you to share it with your brother. <sighs> she has no business in Jessica Walter speaking. That's weird. Opportunities. You like a good business opportunity, don't you, Jessica? How did you know my name? Names aren't important. Opportunities are. And an opportunity awaits you. Step outside and look for it. spoke earlier? Earlier? On the phone. Carl. I know who you are. I, I just don't know who you are. Ah. I'm a businessman. I own this place. What place? Carlsville. It's my town. And I'm looking for a partner. Someone who understands a good business opportunity. Someone who likes to make money. I thought that someone might be Look, I don't even know how I got here. Oh, who knows how they end up where they do. Is that a no? What kind of opportunity? The beverage business. Beverage? You're gonna love it. Selling lemonade. Uh, lemonade. Uh, I'm looking for serious business opportunities here. I'm not selling lemonade. Carlsville has many opportunities. We'll start small, see how you do, and grow from there. Besides, this isn't just any lemonade. You got a made of the shade with Carl's lemonade. Yeah. It's my own special blend. People can't resist it. <laughs> to make a fortune deal. I get 50%? Ouch. You drive a hard car. Deal. Deal. Great. I want you to meet our employee, Nikki. Nikki, I want you to meet my new business partner, Jessica. Jessica. Walters. Whatever. She's in charge. She knows business. Knows what to do. Knows how to make a buck. You listen to her. Do whatever she says. Let's see if we have everything we need. Ah. Oh, Nikki, Jean. don't raise prices. 
I wouldn't want to be accused of unfair business practices in my own town. And I can't be responsible for what happens to greedy little pigs. Good luck. Time to turn up the heat. <laughs> well, let's see how good this stuff really is. Watch, listen, and learn. Good afternoon. Oh, hello there. Oh, what a lovely baby. Oh, thank you. Lemonade. Why, oh, all right. It's warming up a bit, isn't it? Yes, this will cool you right down. Well, thank you. <laughs> well, that is the best lemonade I've ever had. How much do I owe you? One dollar. Well, that's all. Well, give me two more then. Girls, a little something to wet the whistle, if I might. Boy, it's a hot Don't one today. Up. Just halfway. Here you are, sir. Refreshing. How much? One dollar. That would be a bargain at twice the price. Twice, twice the, the price. price. Twice the price. Good day, Gilman. It's a scorcher, isn't it? Give me a lemonade. What's the damage? One dollar. Two dollars. Two dollars? Two dollars doesn't seem like enough for such a delightful lemon beverage. You could charge a fortune. 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 Thank you. I don't think that was such a good idea. You heard what Carl said. And you heard the customers. It's called supply and demand. They like the supply, and we demand more money. You pour, I'll price. Now what are you doing? I'm increasing our inventory. That's cheating. It's not cheating. It's business. At all these cash. Excuse me, excuse me, everybody. I have an announcement to make. We're all out of lemonade. There's only one glass left. Out of lemonade? How could that be? Oh, 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 calm down, everybody, calm down. There is one glass left, and I will be happy to sell it to the highest bidder. What are you doing? Just listen. I'll give you $10. Make it 20 25 90 95 50 100 But a greedy little pig, pig, pig. Carl told you not to be greedy, but you didn't listen. You're 
nothing but a greedy little pig. Get the pig. No. Pig no. goes great with lemonade. But it's not my fault. Carl set me up. Carl? The man who owns the town. Carl could help? Of course he could. Carl loves bacon. Carl! <laughs> Get the pig. What's happening to me? I guess our little partnership must be dissolved. What have you done to me? You hogged the profits. I should have known you were nothing but a greedy little pig. <laughs> you don't belong in business. You don't have the head for it. <laughs> You said you needed money for mom's present, right? Well, well yeah. But I'll give you fifty dollars for it. Fifty bucks? Oh, deal! Fifty bucks! All right, fifty bucks. This town ain't big enough for the both of us. Hey, look at this! Wow, why would anyone throw this away? Hey, grab the other end. Yeah, okay. All right. All right. No more Mr. Nice Guy. Thank you. 